Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, a question is Determine the rate of interest for a sum that becomes 216 by 125 times of itself in 1 by 1 by 2 years, compounded and semi annually. So, this is a question as always. So, first, you had all the information that have been given. So, principal is our rupees. So, no principal is given. So, that principal is our rupees P. Rate of interest it is given. Nothing. So, that x percent per annum. So since it is given semi annual, semi annual means what we do? We just divide the rate of interest by 2. So it will become x by 2 percent per half year. Time is equal to given 1 whole 1 by 2 years. So this is, so this sum if we do in terms of 6 months, so there will be 3 half months. So 3 half year. And amount is also given, it is given 216 by 1 to 5 times of itself. That means 216 by 1 to 5 times of the audit principal. So it becomes 216 by 1 to 5 P. So this is our amount. So now therefore write our formula that is principal into 1 plus rate by 100 to the power n is equal to the amount. So it will become principal is our P into 1 plus rate is our R by 2 sorry x by 2 so x by 2 means 2 into 100 to the power n that is this, to the power 3 is equal to the amount that is 216 by 125 p so we cut the principal we can cut it so now to the power 3 that means this number will be written 3 times so write it 3 times 1 plus x by so 2 into 100 that is 200 Again 1 plus x by 200, 1 plus x by 200 is equal to 216 by 1 to 5. So to reduce the number to only one time, so you have to do the cube root. So you do a cube root here. So, so this side also you have to do the cube root. So cube root means after, from these three numbers only one will be taken. So therefore one number is 1 plus x by 100 only one time you are taking. And here, cube root of 2, 1, 10, 6, and we all know that it is 6, no, 6 only. And 1 to 5 to cube root, it is 5. So now, it takes this 1 to this side. So as it is in addition here, it will go for a subtraction. x by 200 is equal to 6 by 5 minus 1 is equal to x by 200 is equal to. We take the 5 as LCM. 6 minus 5 is equal to x by 200 is equal to 1 by 5. Now x will be equal to now we are taking this 200 to this side as it is in division it will go for multiplication. 1 by 5 into 200 if we cut it it will become 40. So therefore 40 percent is the value of x And also the rate of interest. So this is the final answer for this question. So guys, thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solutions.